I've often heard it said and sung that life is sweetest when you're young. And kids 16 to 21 think they're having all the fun. I disagree. I say it isn't so. And I'm one gal who ought to know. I started young and I'm still going strong. But I've learned as I've gone along that life begins at 40. That's when love and living start to become a gentle art. A woman who's been careful finds that's when she's in her prime. And a good man when he's 40 knows just how to take his time. Conservative or sporty, it's not until you're 40 that you learn the how and why and the what and when. In the 20s and the 30s, you want your love in large amounts. But after you reach 40, it's the quality that counts. Yes, life begins at 40. And I've just begun to live all over again. You see, the sweetest things in life grow sweeter as the years roll on. Like the music from a violin that has been well played upon. And the sweetest smoke is from a mellow broken in old pipe. And the sweetest tasting peach is one that's zoftic, round, and ripe. In the 20s and the 30s, you're just an amateur. But after you reach 40, <laughs> that's when you become a connoisseur. Then it isn't grab and get it, and a straight line for the door. You're not hasty, you're tasty. You enjoy things so much more. For instance, a novice gulps his brandy down. He doesn't understand. Observe a connoisseur, the way he holds it in his hand. How he strokes the glass, fondles it, warms it as he should, smacks his lips, slowly sips. <laughs> Boy, it tastes good. Life begins at 40. Then it isn't hit and run, and you find it much more fun. You romance a girl of 20, and it costs you all your dough. But one of 40 thanks you. She hates to see you go. And girls of 20... All they want are big men, big men with strong physiques. I don't say that it's bad, but you do get tired of those damn Greeks. Life begins at 40, and I'm just living all over again. 